the first dorsal metacarpal artery is a branch of the radial artery arising in the anatomical snuff box. It runs down the radial side of the second metacarpal. A flap supplied by this artery can be designed over the dorsum of the proximal phalanx of the index finger. The flap is often tunnelled subcutaneously into the thumb and it is useful to include a proximal skin extension to decrease the skin tension in the tunnel. Very thin skin flaps are raised to preserve the superficial veins. Then dissection proceeds along the surface of the first dorsal interosseous muscle. This preserves the first dorsal metacarpal artery lying in the subcutaneous fat. A constant branch to the head of the second metacarpal needs to be identified and ligated or diathermied. It is rarely necessary to actually see the artery in the clinical situation. The flap is sensate, being supplied by cutaneous branches of the radial nerve as demonstrated here. These may be divided and joined to a damaged digital nerve if necessary. The flap reaches the tip of the thumb.